still with the fantasy football? You know, I'm surprised more women don't do it. Fantasize? In a football way. Well, how do you know they don't? Well, I don't. I'm just echoing the party line. So what's in it for women? Well, you get to choose from a bunch of hunky men. Is that why you do it? <laughs> no, of course not. <laughs> so, should I pick my guys based on looks or their ability to bring home the bacon? Well, personally, when I look for a man, I look for a man that can provide for me. Which one will have the performance to fill all of my needs? Which fantasy man will whisk me away to the playoffs? You little slut. So I'm starting to like your idea. That's unusual. Which one? I can just pick the 11 cutest guys for your team. Well, you have to have a full team. Oh, so I can't load up on tight ends just because I like the name? No, you have to have a defensive end in there too. So part of my fantasy has to involve a 300 pound offensive guy with the nickname Stink? Well, if you're lucky, you have to choose from whoever's available. So a man that I want could end up on another woman's team while I come to terms about a commitment to a guy who knows that he was my second choice? My fantasy just turned into a soap opera. You could get him in a trade. A man swap? Plus incentives. Who will she choose? Organ music. Dun dun dun! So how'd they play fantasy football before computers? Well, fewer people did it, and you had to make more of an effort. You had to be a man to play the numbers game. Well, you had to be able to eat raw data. Three yards and a cloud full of stats. In a close contest, it was a game of decimals. Where you had to be the denominator or you'll end up in fractions. The keypad pounding world of number crunching action. I have no idea what I'm talking about. Well, according to my ranking, neither do I. What else do you fantasize about? Are we still talking about sports? Balls in your court. Well, baseball's a great fantasy. Really? I always thought guys thought about baseball to break the fantasy. Oh, no, no. The numbers in baseball are thick and lush. You can dive right in there over and over. Okay, sending you to the showers. I, mean, I got guys with million dollar contracts playing for me for a buck. All right, so what else you got? Fantasy basketball? Fantasy hockey. Fantasy soccer. Fantasy lacrosse. Fantasy horseshoes. Fantasy softball. Fantasy kickball. Don't go there. Did you have a bad experience? Stop. <laughs> because of fantasy football, I've lost my emotional center. Who's that? A guy who cries every time he snaps the ball? Very funny. I thought so. No, no, no. I've been focusing so much on individual achievement that I rooted for a team that I hate. And your little fantasy world comes crashing down around you. Come back to reality. Oh, and that big TV's reality? Made even more real by personalized 3D glasses. Enhanced reality. So you can see every tier of that emotional center. You're not taking my fantasy problem seriously. <laughs>